I see a lot of people commending the new president of Nigeria for removing the subsidy. And I'm wondering, I'm wondering why people are supporting this. Because, in my opinion, I stand to be corrected. If the government were doing the right thing in the first place, I don't even think the issue of subsidy will come up. If previous administrations had fixed all the refineries in Nigeria and then we were refining our fuel in Nigeria, I don't think there would be issue of subsidy. Like I said, I stand to be corrected. Why subsidy? In fact, what is even subsidy? Subsidy is a way Niger uh, the, the, the government reduces the price of commodity for its citizens so that they can pay less. Why pay the difference to either the, pro either the producers or the importers? Now, we have God has blessed us with natural resources in this country. We have oil wells all over the place in the south, part of the west, and even some are already coming up in the north. But the problem is our refineries are not working. As we produce this oil, this crude oil, we export them. We export them, and then what do we do? We import them back into the country after it has been refined at a higher amount. And the people that do this are the people that the government pay this subsidy because they are importing it to the country at a higher rate. So for them to make profit, government has to subsidize it. By paying them the difference, why we Nigerians will be buying the fuel at the rate we are buying it? If all the refineries in the country are working, in my opinion, I don't think there will be need for that. I don't think there will be need for that. If all the refineries are working, at all. So, the first thing that the government needs to do is to ensure that the refineries are working. Now, take this analogy for example. If, let's assume I own a palm plantation, maybe palm tree plantation, and then I produce palm kernels, and then I also have a factory where those palm kernels are milled into palm oil. After we people come to buy from me to sell, right? Or I even export them. Now, the people within my immediate environment that will come to me to buy directly because I'm the manufacturer, do you think they'll be buying at the same rates that other people come from, maybe from other countries or from other states to come and buy from me? Do you think the people that are within my immediate environment they will be buying it at the same rates where? Those my customer that come to buy from me to a uh, to from other state or from other country to export will be selling in their various state or in their various country. No, the people that are within my immediate environment will be buying it cheaper. Why? Because there is no cost of transportation. But when we export our crude to other countries and then we import them back, transportation cost is part of it. So the individual or independent petroleum marketers, what do you expect them to do? Nobody wants to do business and don't make profits. They will add their cost of transportation and every other overhead charge to it. That is the subsidy that the government is paying for, paying on behalf of the country, on behalf of the citizens. So my opinion should be that the refineries in this country should be fixed. The money they are the trillions that they are paying on subsidy every year i'm sure is enough to fix more than four refineries in this country recently i saw a video where otedola was saying that himself and dangote 
wanted to buy, I think, what, was it Portaco Refinery? I can't remember. It's like they have people paid for it. But government refunded their money. If government cannot manage all these refineries, let individual, private organizations, let them manage it. Because the major problem we are having that is causing this subsidy issue we are talking about is the fact that our refineries are not working. Government need to fix these things. We cannot be a country where that God has blessed with so much crude oil and all of that and then we are suffering it. We are paying for it at a high rate. I pray that this administration will do the right thing. I don't expect subsidy. Subsidy issue will not even come up if government is doing the right thing. Fix all the refineries and let them be functional. Well, Nigeria cannot afford to move from fire pan to fire in this administration. We suffered in Buhari administration. At the beginning of Tinubu's administration, we are suffering. Queuing in the queuing queue in the fuel station because we want to get fuel. It's not right. We deserve better than this. God bless Nigeria. God bless Nigerians.